Bonnie Griner and I blog at mombyexample.com. I'm a mom of eight and I love to blog and give tips to moms of younger children from a mom of older children in the spirit of Titus too. I was raised in a very loving Jewish home and became a Christian shortly before I was married. Very quickly we had four children in five years, in fact four sons. And I really wanted to raise them in a Christian atmosphere, in a Christian home, but I just really didn't feel like I knew what I was doing. So I started researching and came across the verses, train up a child and talk about the Bible all the time. And so I started making rules. Don't do this, do this, but don't do this when you do that. And it was rule after rule after rule. And when my oldest was about six and my next one was about four, I remember walking out of the room for just a couple minutes and walked back in and my four-year-old was being so naughty. He was doing something I knew he would never do if I had stayed in the room. And it was a light bulb moment because I realized that I was teaching my children to behave by rules and they were reacting and acting out of fear. And that is not what I wanted. That's not how I wanted to train my children. And so I started studying the Bible again and talking to my husband and praying about it. And I understood after reading and praying that I needed my children's hearts. Because if we have a heart that hungers for God, if we have a heart that really loves God, we're gonna to choose to do what's right because it's right and because of that love. So I listed 15 godly characteristics that I loved about God and thought I'm gonna teach the children about God, how much he loves them, what his character is like, and then try to instill those same characteristics into my children. I came up with a plan, I had notebooks full of notes, came up with 15 traits and I would go over one trait a week with my young children from my baby toddler all the way through my six-year-old and we would repeat them we would role model we would role play we would have object lessons we'd memorize verses and I gave one week to each characteristic and after 15 weeks because they were 15 I, we took a break and then after a few weeks or months we started again and eventually I had four more children so we had a total of eight each of them came to a realization of how much God loves them and the neatest part was, I could see that it was, it was really catching. Their hearts had been captured. And so they learned an important tool they could use the rest of their life, that their attitudes and behavior were a choice. And that choice was based on, are they going to do what's right because it's right? Because of their love for God and their honor for God and for, our, and for our, my husband and, and me, their parents? Or were they gonna choose what was wrong and just have maybe a momentary, short amount of pleasure from sin? And they learned it very quickly and it wasn't hard. And then years later in my blog, I started talking about it and people started asking, well, can we order the book? Can we order the book? And I said, there is no book. It's just notebooks full. And then a friend got together with me, Kathy McClure from Frugal Lancaster. And she put all my notebooks full of notes into one manual. She organized it, she made it beautiful. She included coloring pages for little kids and for moms like me that can't sit still. And so for five, 10, 15 minutes a day, each day, you can help your children learn just what God is like and how they can also exhibit godly characteristics. And the light bulbs will go on for them too, I believe that. Information on ordering the book you can find below. Hi, I'm Kathy. The first time I heard Bonnie share her notes about godly character trait training, I scribbled them all down as fast as I could, desperate to record every second of her wisdom. That same day, I started training my kids in these godly character traits too. I loved how simple and practical it was to define the trait, discuss the opposite, and then memorize a verse. Even my two-year-old caught on to memorizing quickly. Not only was I changing their lives for eternity, but I was being filled with a deep joy seeing their light bulbs turn on as I was their teacher. When I designed this book, I really wanted to make it something beautiful for you as a mom. So when you look at it, you have a quick moment of serenity and are filled with inspiration and motivation to keep on persevering. You'll see that we define the trait and give you the opposite of the word so you can discuss it with your children. There are examples for you to live it out and role model it in your home. Over the years, each time Bonnie would teach her children these traits, she'd have them memorize different verses. We've included all of those verses on the left column for you to choose which one is speaking to your family in that season of your life. And at the bottom of every page is a personal note from Bonnie with her tips and words of encouragement to you. 
We are so excited about helping you build a strong foundation of godly character traits in your children that we want to help you succeed in every way possible. So this summer, we're going through eight of the character traits with you. We're forming a special Facebook group for you to be part of as you go through these traits with your children. Bonnie will do live videos in the group to introduce each week's godly character trait to see how things are going with your family and to answer questions. It will be a community for you to support other moms, hold each other accountable, and share ideas on how you're implementing the lessons in your home. The Facebook group will run from the middle of June to the middle of August, just enough time for us to cover eight of the 15 character traits with our families. And don't worry, if you'll be on vacation a week, all the videos will be saved so you can go back and gain Bonnie's insight and wisdom at any time. We want you to join us. You'll find a link below to save your spot in the community. We'll help you instill godly character traits in your children that will last a lifetime. We look forward to getting to know you more.